do 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 I've got a great pirate story I want to share with you. Don't worry, I'm not going to continue some kind of fake pirate um, talking throughout this video because I can't do it. I'm not that good. Um, <laughs> I wanted to share with you, though, this story called The Treasure of Pirate Frank. Um, it is by Mal Pete and Elizabeth Graham. Um, this is the first U.S. printing, I believe it came out at the end of 2017. I want to be sure. Things I should have checked. My cat is getting into this, I think, because he might like the hat. I don't know. Um, this is a cumulative story. And <laughs> Tom, come on, scooch over. Okay, this is a cumulative story. And cumulative text or predictive stories are so important for younger kids when they're learning to read. Um, knowing the rhythm of the story and the rep re bleh, repetitive um, phrases gives the child a chance to guess what's going to be said next and be right. Um, so it really builds confidence. It helps them learn the flow of language. Um, this is much like... Um, the house that Jack built, but it is the treasure of Pirate Frank. And it starts off with, in the beginning, let me show you. This is the boy, I can't read it because the sun's glaring on it. This is the boy who wants to find the treasure of Pirate Frank. And Tom's not letting you look, but there we go. Why does he have to sit right in the middle of the table? Come on. He's going to knock over the tripod. Okay. This is the map that shows the way to the treasure of Pirate Frank. And it continues to build on that with the story until the little boy pirate finds Pirate Frank, who is actually... There we go. There's Pirate Frank. And it says on here, This treasure belongs to Captain Sally Frank. Hands off. So it's great. It has a boy and a girl pirate. This is really good. Again, it's a cum cumulative story. Great illustrations. Kind of cartoonish in nature. Fun, predictive story. <clears throat> it, um... Let me check here. I can tell you when it came out. Oh, let's see. Yeah, 2017. So I think it came out at the end of 2017. It's great for a story time. Um, I like stories like this because they really engage the kids. It gets them to participate in the storytelling. So you're not simply just reading the story to the child, but they can actually engage and participate in the storytelling as well. Um, it's like that with any predictive book or any cumulative story. So check this one out, The Treasure of Pirate Frank, um, at your local library or local bookstore. Thanks and have a great day.